Hey friend, today is gonna to be fun because I have a thrift haul for you. We have the clothes galore all around me at my feet and I'm excited to show you all the things I grabbed at the thrift store the other day while I was there. Um, I was in search for some fall clothing. We wanna get some nice uh, pieces for that. <laughs> and also I have been wanting to add a little bit more color with some like basics. My favorite store that I go shopping at frequently, it has everything in the store for $1. And that's where I like to shop because, you know, I love a good deal and I love to have variety in my clothes and so that's the best way I can do that. So let's pop over to the footage from the other day of the thrift store and then we'll come back here and I will show you all the good things I grabbed. Headed to the thrift store today again. I'm looking for some clothes. I have found a couple of good things over the last couple of weeks and I'm just looking around at my fall wardrobe. <sighs> You know, being postpartum is a little bit crazy with getting dressed and all the things. So, you know, looking forward to getting some new to me, new, new to me items. found some great stuff in the store and I'm excited to try it on. I never get to try things on when I'm out thrift stopping because I have the baby usually strapped to me and it's just, it's just a whole thing. So I usually just take a gamble and hopefully everything will fit. Um, yeah, but if not, it's only a dollar, so I'll just donate it back. <laughs> All right, well, let's head home and see what we got. Okay, so I grabbed some great stuff while I was there and let's just jump right into what I found. So the first thing I found was this really beautiful purple, like lavender color button down shirt and the fabric is linen. It says pure Irish linen. So that makes it even cooler in my opinion, <laughs> but this will be great for just layering on top of things while I'm running to the grocery store or whatever. It's very casual, but a little bit more put together. And that's kind of what I'm going for most days. And I think this will be great for fall. The next top that I found was a little bit more, I don't know, dress, dressy, but I thought the fabric and the pattern was really beautiful. It's red with um, gray and black little medallions, and it does it has like a tie up top, which I tend to like these types of tops, and it does have a little small shoulder pad, so that'll be interesting. <laughs> Let me tilt this down a little bit. But we'll see. See how we like it. This next one I picked purely because I loved the color. This is such a beautiful color for fall or any time of the year, I think. It is this dark, deep teal, and it feels very soft. Let's see. It's made of polyester, but it feels great. And it is like a long button-down shirt that has... It's just really well made. It seems it's got a nice pocket here. I don't know. So this will be a great layering piece. And I can see there's a couple different ways I would wear this, but we'll have to try it on and see how it works. I found this sweater. I thought this was beautiful because it has like the, the contrasting collar and it has a very nice knit to it. I thought that was interesting. It's a three quarter sleeves. And it is very classic. I love good black and white moment. And so I thought this would be very versatile this fall. Okay. So I've been looking for a colorful blazer for a while and something in my, something that suits my tone and everything. And I thought this one was beautiful. It's like, it's red, bright red. And it's got a couple buttons here. And in fact, there's, actually there's, just one button and there's an extra button here for if I need it but I thought this was a really pretty one it's definitely vintage and we'll see how it fits so I loved this one because it's the plaid was just perfect 
this could be winter, fall, all the more cooler months. And it's nice and soft. And I just thought it was so pretty. So I had to pick it up and we'll see how it fits. It's a size medium, so it might be a little tight. We'll see. Okay, this one I'm not sure about. I don't even know why I picked it up, to be honest. I'm looking at it now and going, what was I thinking? But <laughs> it's kind of fun, but it is, it's very big. I didn't notice how big it was, I don't think. But it's a 3X, which is definitely not my size. So we'll see how that works out. Maybe there's a way I can wear it to make it work. But it's, I thought it was really pretty. had a nice knit to it. And I don't know, I liked the vintage feel of it. But I think it's too big. And then I just love a classic cardigan moment. Sometimes you just got to throw on a cardigan and you feel a little bit more put together. This one's a Target brand. And it's just a pretty color. This purple is is one of my favorite colors so I can pass this one up just a, a basic cardigan but I know I'll get some use out of this one this next cardigan is like a yellow color and it says made in the British Isles I think this is yeah this is lamb's wool so it's very nice but I don't know about the color for me it's a little bit wrong I think so I might be giving this to somebody, probably to my sister, who is coming to visit. So she's probably going to get this sweater, but uh, I don't know. We'll try it on and we'll see. We'll see. You never know. This one has a undershirt and an over sweater. This is a Ralph Lauren brand. And I don't know. I thought it was cute. I was attracted to the color and the style of it. Like I said, I love a good cardigan moment. I feel like they're great for dressing up or down and I just think they're fun for fall so we'll see how this fits so these pants are Jeffrey Bean and they're just a nice pin back or pin stripe uh, capri slack I thought these were very nice they are size 14 so it's a little lower than what I normally wear so we'll see how it works but I thought these were really fun I've never had one of these before, but I thought this was really fun. It's actually a, I don't know what you call these, like a wrap of some sort. I can't remember what they're called. Poncho. It's a poncho. So it's Chico's brand poncho. I will have to show you this on because it's hard to hold up, but it's just black and red. I thought this was really pretty. And honestly, I've never had anything like this before, so I don't really know how to wear it or what to do with it, but we'll see how it goes. We're branching out. So I did grab this basic tee. It's brand Chico and it's just a pl an eggplant purple kind of color and we love a good basic tee moment. This is a size zero, which is size large. So yeah, I thought this was pretty and nice and perfect for fall. And the last item of clothing that I found was this sweater and it's got short sleeves but it's bright red I mean I'm just really into red apparently I was super attracted to red at the store but this one is nice it's got a nice um, knit to it very stretchy and it seems very um, comfortable it's Andrea Vicaro brand in a size medium so I thought this was really pretty and I could definitely see myself wearing it hopefully it fits <laughs> So I did get some accessories this time because I watched a video the other day that told me I need to accessorize with scarves, skinny scarves particularly, this fall. So I did grab a few scarves. This one I thought was so pretty with the purple and the houndstooth pattern and the red. I love it. I could wear it in my hair or around my neck. just thought it was really pretty. The colors are great. And I looked at it and saw that it was a, let me make sure if I can see it. This is an Oscar, Lo, Oscar de la Renta studio brand. So this is a really nice high-end brand and I thought it was so pretty. So grabbed it. I'm glad to have this in my And I grabbed this one as well. It's a Liz Claiborne scarf with leaves on it. This one's more like just a little neck scarf, nothing too crazy, but it's small and cute. I thought this would be fun for fall. It has leaves on it. 
Then I grabbed this scarf, which is really pretty. It has a nice floral motif and it's silky smooth. I think it is silk. I thought this one was pretty with the pattern. So the last one I grabbed is a little teeny skinny scarf. And I think with this one, instead of wearing it around my neck, I think I'm going to use it as a hair tie for sure. Because I thought this would be really cute as a hair tie in the fall. Since it's so, it's such a perfect size for tying up my hair. So I thought that would be cute. So I might have to play with that this year to see, to see some, you know, fun ways of styling a cute hair tie. All right, so I did grab a few belts and the first one I grabbed was this interesting like metal belt. I don't know. I was just kind of attracted to the cool design of it. I just feel like it's different and weird and quirky and I love it. This will be great for going around a skirt and we'll see how we can work, make this work, but I couldn't pass it up for one dollar. I just thought it was too cool and different. And the last thing I grabbed was this fun sunflower belt in gold and it'll be the same kind of like an accent to help give definition at the waist. I just thought it was really really cool and different and I love flowers so yeah this was a fun belt. Alright, thanks for joining me today. We got through all the clothes haul. It was a lot of fun. So I counted it up and I got 21 pieces. And so that means I spent $21 on all of these items. And I'm excited to have them. And for the ones that didn't work out, you know, that's okay too. That's kind of a risk you take at this particular thrift store. They have a changing area, but I can never do it because I'm usually wearing my three-month-old baby. <laughs> so, uh... It's really hard to get him in and out of that, so the sling. So anyway, I just don't worry about changing in the. So it's just for one dollar, I'm like it's worth the risk. Let's just try it on at home. Anyway, but thanks for joining me today on my thrift haul, and it's fun to see all the new finds people are finding out there. So let me know if you found any good stuff at the thrift store lately, and I hope you're having fun with your fashion. That's kind of what my goal is in the next little while because I've been in a rut a little bit with wearing wets and just mom clothes all the time so I've, I've been itching to get out there and wear more color and have more fun with my wardrobe so this will hopefully give me a jump start to do that anyway i hope you have a great day today thank you so much for stopping by and i will see you in the next video bye if you're interested in checking out my watercolor artwork please head over to my website at stateofapril.com